Someone's shooting at us! Well, if they weren't, we wouldn't be at AK-47 Stadium here in Hexon, Texas. Bring your body armor to the stadium or wear a body bag for the ride home in the hearse. And this is gonna be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Grim Bay attackers battle the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. I'm a If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. And it's first and ten. <laughs> lateral to his teammate we're talking street ball here if there were any functioning brain cells before that hit they're gone now he's gonna have the iq of a rutabaga after that hit second down the size of bricks wiener hey sorry partner opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. You gotta keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. This guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and 10. Third down and the punter is warming up. way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten in a fight between King Kong and Godzilla the player on roid rage oh and did he just put on a display there touchdown Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy, and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Second down and long. And like every one of my barbecues, this guy's on fire. Does he like original or extra crispy? Bill looks like extra crispy. First and ten. 
And they stake the line, and he gets his bell run for a yard. Second down and nine. for four yards. Third and four. Well, that play didn't work. He'll have to rethink that. Time to see if this is an elite kicker. Can he kick through a cement wall? And probably not Bricks. Then he's not a lead. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. I'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking, and he don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. If they don't pick it up, the offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. defense it's not too often a quarterback gets rejected that's why that's the position i originally tried out for i want to know what it's like for other people to accept you now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings stop it this isn't a place to feel feelings this is football first down he was not going to drop that one they need to make him a target more often Scored, did it? How good can it be? It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Second down and five. like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and five. Oh, he just got crushed. Well, I want Sean Kicker make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a gun. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was Tripod Jenkins, the one with the big slump. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first.
first and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out because if he gets hit, oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard? trick the last play is a race how did they do that did they go 88 miles per hour just ask oh man what a throw that sonic blast just cleared the oh what a punishing hit that was and that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size because he just walked all over him and it's first and ten Second down and more than the QB would like. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and, well, good luck. You've got to catch that. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, MFL isn't at straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Second down and four. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down and the punter is warming up. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. And that is that guy's brain getting crushed out of his helmet. Oh, the defender lays down a wicked hit and knocks the ball loose. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. Defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And that'll bring up second and one. two-minute warning, folks. Stay tuned for the halftime show. 
third and four. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. What is this, Andy's wrestling? And it's first and ten. Oh, my gosh! The defensive player looks like he's lost his run! That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Threads the needle for a first down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And it's first and ten. Two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Second down and nine. Save some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the points and let's move on. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Some bribe money as they head to their lockers. 
Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? It's not too fast. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. That's a two-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. Third down and eight. today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grammy. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he went off to the races. Yeah, They want more points, so they're going for two. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion! He could probably be a better dancer if he went to dance class, but as you can see, he uh, doesn't have the stomach for it. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. didn't give an inch. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? down and long. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. 
deflection. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss. Nice catch, and he turns on the after. You can't keep a good mutant down. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Smokes, he just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. World, ruin it. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he's running like a moose in yard pick up there. Normally a first down, but here, he's just making up ground. Yeah, like the way the commish makes up news. Third down, and the punter is warming up. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he first through the end zone for six. Dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? Ah, uh, did they? Didn't they just? Uh, am I losing my mind? Or did that play that I saw just not happen? Uh, I gotta stop smoking them on tidy laundry pods. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt. And oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. And the QB might as well just bury himself now. Boom, dead and down. Send a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. At some point, they're going to need to put this rep out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks attack the rep. First and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. I love that show. 
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot. was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. in that incomplete pass. Uh, not a ball's feelings are hurt. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? Second down and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I'm going to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Third down and, well, good luck. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Oh, boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck. You kill a ref. It's not murder if they have in common, right? Take the hit. Do something about that ref, you pussies. Well, here comes the punting. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. This 
is your brain, and this is your brain on Berserker Drugs. Is that, is that guy's brain getting crushed out of his helmet by that guy whose brain is on Berserker Drugs? Second down and a lot. Wow, the quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First down and six. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down his guy in a speed thing, grip. He's running from his name. It's clear. Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Brick can't even get one. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. My vacuum cleaner can dance better than that. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Two minutes left in the game. Thank God I gotta take a wicked dump. Feel like I'm sitting on a wax candle. Not on my shoulder, you know. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Roid Rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. Uh, I'll take a Roid Rage with a vodka chaser. It'll make it snappy way you, Shorty. He could go all the way. He's at the 20, the 10. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. And here comes the extra point attempt. feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. for a second there. Second down and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time and the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, man, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line, and then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hits. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Talk about 
Butterfingers. He should have had that one. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and one. And that'll be their final timeout. First down and one. nothing out of it. Come on, nice and easy, right through the uprights. The Oilers spoiled the opposition chance to win and walk away victorious. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? Why pay for admission? I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, wait, I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Girls. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.